Welcome guys to the new Memory of Chaos Chronicle of the White Knight Dream Kingdom number 11 so in here I will give you some uh, guide how to finishing it as an F2V player ish <laughs> not like F2V player like you wanted like a uh, or like a four star character type thing but it's yeah here we go like i know it i know it there is akron there is kafka and black swan but from eight character in here only three are uh, limited uh, five star character doctor ratio is kind of like a free ish because everyone have the doctor, doctor ratio so the ratio now the ratio got it the ratio now is uh, a bit better than the last time so at least in here you can changing it uh like uh, some character like Akron with a uh, Serpa for instance. So, uh, I will not talking about uh, uh, stage buff. I, I already is uh, talking it in uh, stage number number two, uh, number seven. So in here I will talk uh, talk about uh, the the battle itself. So uh, node one in here, electric wind and quantum. Uh, weakness for our enemy in here. Uh, in wave one, we are gonna focusing on get keep uh, our method in here because uh, he was the one who gonna uh, immobilize us and also uh, he gonna throw out some uh, koi fish minion. So it's kind of cumbersome. So we deal with this uh, our our method first. The decaying shadow is also gonna. Uh, uh immobilizing us but it's kind of like uh take a bit more time so we can uh destroy his uh weakness break first and when seek uh when a uh, shadow uh giving not giving uh trying to using his lock uh, ability now that's time for us uh to destroy uh her her weakness break so it's kind of like this one first this is second one so it's kind of like that, but sometimes it's not that simple, especially if you are if you are kind of using Akron. Sometimes the uh, the uh, cannot I forget the name. <laughs> That's the last dream. Uh, crimson knot. Sometimes crimson uh, the crimson knot is um uh lay upon uh the wrong enemy that we don't want to attack first, like. For instance, I want to destroy the get uh, our method, but it goes here first if I know wrong. So yeah, yeah. So uh, it's a bit of RNG in, in there if you are using Akron. I'm sorry, guys. So that's it uh, for the first one. It's quite simple, simplistic, and you can destroy it with uh, uh, almost every DOT in here. Uh, Quantum, I don't know, man. After using quantum for the our method, when we fighting with decaying shadow, it's kind of less effective. So I don't know what quantum uh, character in here. So in the wave two in here, we are not gonna thinking too much about uh, doom screen. It's gonna be destroyed as long as you have a destruction character or some type of AOE attack. So uh, in wave two in here, we are focusing on Yan Chi. If you don't have character like uh, Akron in here, Akron, like Black Swan, uh, Blade, maybe Kafka uh, somehow, uh, something like that, you need to destroy uh, Yanqing ASAP uh, before he throwing out uh, his uh, flying sword. Because it's gonna be a uh, much longer time to destroy to uh, defeating uh, Yan Qing when you are uh, attacking like using your ultimate or skill when there is a flying flying sword so doing it ASAP in here oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. there you go in here I'm using Akron uh, Kafka and Black Swan they are really really good uh, team community I know I know that's it uh, this is uh, only in the first node. In the second node, I'm fully uh, F2P friendly. So in the first node in here, 
with a uh, acron it's gonna be making it us quite faster especially in here i'm using j part and j part is i'm i'm putting a dislike con on j part ah oh man i made mistake <laughs> i made mistake okay i still managing it managing it all don't like me uh, using this uh icon switching it to uh this light uh not this light con uh, trend of uh the universal market man using this one so with this one you can have um more skill point for acron that's why man man i made this <laughs> that that's why it's a, a feel a bit uh, longer to defeating yan Qing, man with with Jeffart, bruh. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm changing it now. Okay, good. I think that's it for the first uh, node. Uh, for the second node in here. In second node, there is a physical, a win, and imaginary weakness for our enemy. So in here, it's up to you. It's up to you, but the easiest one is physical and uh imaginary because there is not much a good uh, fire character in this game yet so far there's some uh, the, the, the good one in uh, in here that i'm what i'm thinking a lot is topaz and nambi topaz and nambi uh plus doctor ratio in here is really really good especially against the this gorilla this is gonna be really really good but if you don't have one of those or both, it's gonna be really really bad for you. So in here, I think you you're gonna have a doctor ratio uh, anyway. But Topaz, uh, it's it's the pan. So yeah, win is not really good in here. We cannot attack uh, Ronya with win. So forget about win. So basically, just using physical and imaginary with physical in here i'm using clara clara is really really good in here if you don't have clara there is still a good thing like uh um mc or the one that i'm quite thinking is luca luca is good because luca get a uh, buff uh, his basic basic attack can get buff so you can like uh preserve your skill point and using it on other the uh, teammate so Luka is quite good. I'm gonna uh, finishing uh, uh, building Luka too. So yeah, I think that's for Luka. Uh, for imagine uh, for physical, I think there's another physical character. If I'm not wrong. Oh yeah, Argenti. Argenti is quite good, but Argenti is more toward AO and not like focusing to one thing. Sushang is quite good, but Sushang is a bit demanding on skill point so it's up to you for imaginary like you said like like i said before there is doctor ratio where's the ratio doctor ratio there is well i'm using well too in here well it's quite good especially to uh, slowing down the gorilla so the gorilla is gonna be a bit uh slower you can attacking him before he uh become immune to uh elemental weakness and in here for physical i'm using clara uh clara, because uh, clara is just cheap so i can using a lot of uh, almost all skill point on wealth and doctor ratio and i'm putting a sustainer in here uh Beilu because Beilu is uh quite i think most of people are gonna have a Beilu in, in in some uh capacity like when you for for someone you have bail something like that so bail so yeah there you go in second half uh, in node 2 is fully f2p friendly absolutely so i think uh that's it oh yeah in the first uh, node i think if you don't have electrical character and wind character like mine it's, it's easy like you can using uh, for electrical force first you can using uh, like uh serva or uh it's kind of bad but you can using our one as long as you have uh like, like j part or something to shielding it i think it's still 
okay is for we there's a lot uh, to to choose choose for there is a sample there is a danhang i i i'm quite sure i'm quite liking danhang here more than sample so yeah there's also blade if you pull for him so yeah for a win there's a lot in it also you can put a brony in there too if if you want to so that's it uh for this one so i'm so sorry guys <laughs> i'm using a uh, acron here but it is what it is man it is what it is so uh thank you so much for everyone watching this video and if you like this kind of content you can go to panglima.star.page and there you can find all of my social media and how to support me i just say hi when i'm live streaming next time so and also you can check the action uh version in top uh right corner or in description so thank you so much bye